This week has been super exciting for Carl and me. The welder came and he fixed the holes. Well, that's a, a great progress on the project list. And um, yeah, I'm happy. I'm happy it's done. It did take a long time to take the decision whether to weld it or epoxy it and who to use as a welder. In the end, I decided for a um, German guy who lives at the other side of the canal in Panama City. And those people of you who've been to Panama, you might actually know him. He's the father of Eric Bauhaus, who has written the cruising guide Bible for Panama. So people who've been to Panama, they probably know that guy. But one hour before he came, he told me on the phone, well, get some 220 volt for the welding. So. Yeah, that was short time notice, so I had to try and organize um, the compressor of the marina. They told me that there would be gasoline in there for three hours, but eventually after 10 minutes I ran out of gas, so I had to organize some more gasoline. It was already late, so the office was closed, so I had to ask uh, some help from some other sailors to get some gasoline. But we did manage to fill it up again, and um, the welder could keep on going. pretty hard to weld between the keels because the welder kept on um, well swearing a little bit because if you weld like upside down it's it's a little bit tricky because the aluminum gets like really really hot and liquid very fast so it's it's difficult to actually make it stick on the on the ceiling. Eventually he closed all the holes and um, at the end of the day we had a couple of beers and just you know talked a little bit because he's a quite interesting guy, he's got lots of stories to tell and yeah it was nice and he's gonna come back to actually weld on my anodes um, in about a week or so. So that's great. One more thing I wanted to do this week or what I started this week was um, I actually did decide to make another attempt to take the paint down to bare aluminum. Because it will be pretty tricky to put on the edge primer if I have primer and like bare aluminum places. So it would be much easier if I was down to bare aluminum at the whole boat. So I bought some paint remover, which is really expensive. It costs like $30 a gallon. And um, well, I did some trial runs to see how best to put it on, how thick and how much time to leave it. And um, yeah, then I went for the boat. First I thought it was um, really easy, but then I, I noticed that actually it's um, quite some work as well, it's pretty tiring. And um, I think I'm going to get some help from someone because my arms are starting to get tired and and also time is money and I've been spending a lot of time on the heart so it's really, it's time to leave, it's killing my budget. Um, so maybe, maybe it'll be a good idea to get some help. But I hope that next week I'll be down to bare aluminum on, on the whole boat and um, then I just have to put some epoxy above the welded bits and then I can start painting. That's going to be a nice job. Um, yeah, that's about it. See you next week. Bye.